All right, what's up, guys? Um, sorry I've been gone for a while. Uh, I haven't been. I think I don't think I posted it for two weeks. It's been so far. I'm back. I was just uh, had my birthday. Like I went to Catalina, and I, I don't know. I was just getting tired. Um, I didn't really want to record. I wasn't doing anything. But now I'm back. Um, I'm gonna be posting some videos for you guys. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and purchase my fuel pump, like I said in the last video, valve springs, retainers, all that, and tear apart the Evo to get it ready for hopefully 600 horsepower, if not five, 400. I don't know. We'll see what it makes. I'm in the daily right now. Sorry if you guys can't hear me. I have the AC blowing. I just bought the daily. I think I posted it. No, I didn't post it. I didn't post it. 91 to our cell. Mainly the only reason why I bought it. Alright, so let's get it started and back on the grind. Come on, guys. Always to find it. car I got it's pretty clean it's a Tarsal Toyota I got it for super cheap automatic yeah but I think it'll be a good daily maybe I could get it to look good no dents anywhere no roof so excellent probably get a paint job and slam it with some rims I don't know if people fix these things up I might do it though just for fun video the car like struggled to turn on and I'm just gonna leave it running for a little bit I think I might need a new battery not too sure all right guys so basically what I'm gonna use is I like I mentioned earlier this double-sided tape and I'm gonna go ahead and put it on for you guys and I got a little blade to cut it so <music> thin tape and just let me peel this off for you guys it's because if you look right here like it has this little lip right here and if you get it too thick it's gonna like it's not gonna sit on the car good it's like that perfect size like it, it matches up evenly and that way it just looks flush like it doesn't look like horrible you know but you can't you also can't get it too thin because if you get it way too thin it's just not even you know, like that lip's gonna prevent it from sticking on there Like a nerve, nerve wracking thing, something like this. Hopefully, I get it right. too thick of tape 
you would have a big old gap right here and you don't want that, you know, want to look nice and clean. So hopefully it looks good. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Looks like there's a little gap right here, but see that double-sided tape. Hopefully, oh, I still need to screw the bot bottom on, so let me go ahead and do that. Oh yeah, that's what holds it right there, those two bolts. The screws, I don't know, however, what do you call them, but see how they're hella big? Oh, you're not going to see them, so I guess it'll be alright. I think the video, so this just clips in there, like so, put it back, and then just screw this right back on. I'm kind of stupid, I just realized what I could have done right now. I sh didn't have to take off the wheel because I bought this. Um, this is like OEM. You didn't have to take this one, but I'm just making sure it's tight. I bought these OEM or not OEM, but factory uh, mud flaps or mud guards. I don't know, whatever you call them. And um, they come with like, they're, I think they're like tens. So I probably, I could have just used the ten to put them on, take it off. But oh, well, I guess I'll check my brakes. Might as well have the wheel off. And I don't know if I mentioned in my other video, I do have coilovers. They're Megan Racing coilovers. I believe they're 32 way adjustable. Yep. All right, so I'm all finished up with putting that on. I'm gonna go ahead and put my wheel back on. so I don't know if the video was good enough like with all the audio and everything but just at the car wash we're done about to go eat right now finally finished washing two cars evil's all nice and clean you can see about to take off to go eat probably wing stop mm -hmm.